this cement without any chemical material. If you look to here, you can see this is system here. It's dowling or dovetail or male and female. You see here this one block, this second block here. And they make a hole here like a dovetail and here like a dovetail and fold this area here with wood or stone. Here the wide narrow, wide narrow so it can't separate. And how we join this one with the second one, they make a tongue with the same idea. How we join the upper one with the lower one, and when we put the wood or the stone, it became higher. So the upper one linked with the lower one, linked with the side one, so it can't separate. And here you can see the obelisk, all the obelisk here, one piece, 350 tons, one block of stone, is from granite, it's holding the name and the title of the king and all the achievement of the king. And the upper part of the obelisk is covered with mixture, with mixture between gold and silver. And the gold is the color of the sun and silver is the color of the moon. So in the day, a reflection, sun rays. So from when the people see the reflection of sun rays from far away, oh, this is the blaze, this is the timber, like landmark inside the timber, like the minaret, like a steeple in the church. How many Egyptian obelisks can hold the world? About, one, uh, about 50 Egyptian obelisks can hold the world. One in Square Concord in Washington, uh, one in Square Concord in Paris, one in Washington, one in New York, two in Istanbul, two in England, 22 in Italy. Why 22 in Italy? Because the Italian is a Roman, and the Roman here conquered it for, empire for about 100 years. So you can see most of the monument in Italy now. So you take most of the monument with them. Oh, okay. Thanks. Yeah.